Hello everybody, my name is Megan and welcome back to a fragment of her. So last episode we were trying to find a code to Selena's bank account. So let us continue by searching through her things. Maybe the code's in a coat pocket? No it isn't. Where else could it be? Uh, da, 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 canvases. Fresh canvases that are waiting to become pieces of art. Maybe I've put the bank account code into one of my trouser pockets? Nope, no code in my trouser pockets. Alright. Oh gosh, I should really unpack my moving boxes sometime. Maybe I will be that the code is somewhere in there. Nope, damn it, the bank account isn't in, in here. Alright. Maybe the code's in the pocket of one of my shirts. Damn it, the shirt pockets are empty. No code. I love books. Maybe I use the code as a bookmark. Nope. I haven't got time to rest. I've got to find the bank account code. Uh, Alright, another pile of books. There we go. Perfect. Maybe I'll find the code somewhere between these books. It's worth a try. Of course, here it is. I use this little paper with the code on it as a bookmark. I should be able to use that to withdraw money for the camera at the bank. I'll hit the road in just a moment. Oh, let's go camera shopping. Yes. Alright, we made progress. Look, I have the camera. That's amazing. You should start taking photos right away. You're right. Better not waste any more time. See you around. Sure. Oh! Now we have like a little inventory here. This is nice. I have to use a camera to pho photograph the paintings. Oh, do I have to like... Mm, actually, I haven't gotten the slightest idea how to operate this thing. Nothing's happening when I'm pressing the buttons. Is the camera even on? I think I really need a tutorial. Uh, la la la. I have no idea how to use a camera. Then what the fuck are we here for? Uh, I don't know how to use a camera. Uh, God, should we talk to one of the students? Hello? He's still ignoring me. I've been at the uni for a while now, but the other students are still avoiding me. I better leave them be. Gosh darn it, color theory, biographies, art theory. Ugh. Do I have to find a book on how to use a fucking camera? Anatomy, philosophy, various topics. I'm here to take pictures, not to read. Well, I'm sorry, you don't know how to fucking use a camera. Uh, la la la. Maybe we should ask Tomoko. Hey, Tomoko. Hey, Selena. So, how are you doing? Well, I have this great camera now, but I have no clue how to handle it. Oh, could you maybe give me a little tutorial on how to handle the device? That would be great. Selena, I'm studying literature. Books are the only gadgets I know hot. Sorry, I have no idea either. No problem. Any ideas on how to figure cameras out? Hmm, let me think. I don't know any photographers, and there is no course on the uni. Have you tried the bookshelf? It's worth a try. We're gonna have to look around. Thanks. Don't mention it. Good luck. Alright, back to square one. We look through here. Let's go to philosophy. Lots of books on philosophy. I hardly think I'm gonna find something on photography here. Anatomy? Books on anatomy. There isn't anything on the topic of photography here. Alright, color theory. Okay. I'll shut I'll shut up. Books on color theory. There isn't anything on photography. Biographies. Various biographies. Nothing on photography. Welp, all there's left is art theory. Plenty on the topic of art theory. There's no literature or photography. Then what the fuck? <sighs> okay, do we have to That's right. <laughs> I forgot that if we don't move forward, these would disappear. And before we even move forward, these would still show up in. Alright, various topics. Okay. I'm confusing all of you, I'm sorry. Random books across all genres. If I wanted to find anything on the topic of photography, it's going to be here. Cookbook. Oh, yes. That's definitely on the subject of photography. Those two guides, cinema, photography for from beginner to pro. Photography from beginner to pro. Alright, that's exactly what I was looking for. I'll start reading it right away. Alright. 
Alright. Now everything's clear to me. I doubt that I have what it takes to become a top photographer, but it should be enough to photograph Seligman's paintings. Alright. Let's do this one. I have to take pictures of all the presents. Oh, will still be able to calmly study his style and his technique at home. Uh, use now. Boop. Concentrate. Oh shit! I did it. Uh oh, we're still using it. Uh, all right. Perfect. Uh, this one. And boobies. <laughs> oh, do I have to do all of them? So this one as well. All right. All right. Let's do this one now. Uh, this one. And now uh, this one. That's all of them. R right? I hope that's it. Oh, there's a tiny one in the corner. God damn it. Alright, I'll get back to that. <laughs> I've turned the camera off again. Alright, uh, this one. Got it! That should be the last painting. My work here is done. Perfect! Now I just have to get these photos developed, then I can study them thoroughly. Oh jeez. I finally developed the pictures. Okay, so we're definitely- <laughs> That took forever. If that, uh, doesn't ring a bell in the very beginning, we are definitely not in the 21st century right now, probably in uh, 80s or 90s, probably. So yeah, we're definitely not in the 21st century uh, where you could just do anything with cameras and cameras are everywhere. Um, all right, uh, all right, let's just focus on our painting. All righty, hmm, interesting. Oh, well, now that I'm able to study Seligman's paintings in peace, I've noticed how similar to each other they all are. Considered more closely, he always used the same methods. He's constantly repeating the same patterns. And his choice of subjects is also rather, well, one-dimensional. Besides, I've just noticed a few times where he was really sloppy with his technique. Oh, she calling you out! <laughs> that definitely couldn't have been on purpose. Could it be? Could it be that Professor Seligman isn't as, as, as brilliant as he claims? <gasps> oh shit, she be throwing shade like is the fucking rice at a wedding. Took me time to do that one. Oh, I'm clever. I'm going to try and incorporate everything I was able to learn in abstract from uh, Seligman's paintings. I've even included his favorite subject, semi-nude to nude women. But unlike him, I try to not depict them plump and one-dimensional. Ooh. And somehow my work turned out rather bleak again. I didn't even intend it to be. No matter how much I intended not paint such a picture, at some point I always veer off and voila, the next picture is completed bleak. Hmm. It's almost as if there's a second dark Selena inside of me who dictates that I paint without me even noticing. But that sounds crazy, right? Hmm. Sometimes I feel like I'm going nuts. Especially every time those pictures appear in my head again. If I wouldn't immediately start to paint afterwards, I probably would have gone insane already. Okay. Gets a little more into Selena's state of mind, but still not a lot of... Any, of a, a lot of uh, detail to go into what's going really really going on with her but that as it may I'm finished with my painting now I wouldn't know how to Im further improve it <sighs> I'm eager to know how Professor Seligman is going to react to that he'll just have to love it after all I might as well be one of his own oh shit she's just throwing shade left and right oh, I love her 
You're late again. At least we know where to start. Give me your painting. Fine. Oh, I see what's going on here. So we'll do it different this time. Where do you think you improved in this last week? Hmm. The brushwork, the motif, or the colors? Uh, the motif. The motif. Yes, marvelous. I'm amazed by how far you managed to come in just a week. But, ugh, fuck. What is it? Are you trying to insult me here? This is nothing but the shameless mockery of my excellent style. The brushwork is lazy. Do you not- do you put any time in it at all? But, the colors are off. Everything here looks just wrong. You. And the motif makes me shiver, not in a good way. So, for crying out loud, girl. Open your eyes. You should already, that's enough. Oh my god. Can we sass him? Oh my god. Should we be mean? Or should we sass him? Let's, let's sass him. You, that's it. That is your final warning. You'll have to one more chance to convince me. Wait, I didn't say anything? I must be mentally disturbed or something. Hey, Selena. Take a deep breath. Don't lose it over that jerk. God, you must be so upset. I'm going crazy. Fuck it, I'm out of here. It says nothing. Uh, let's go to this one. I feel like I'm going crazy. If crazy means better, come on. Look at your work objectively. There has been so much improvement. Do you really mean it? That jerk just has it on you. You think so? Absolutely. Anyway, I don't know what to do anymore. I've given all I had on my last painting. I just don't know how I'll be able to improve even further in that short amount of time. Huh. The book on painting from last time really did help you. It did. But I'm pretty sure I've already read all that could help me. But you mentioned that other book. Yes, the other one my girlfriend was taking with her all the time. So you're talking about a book that isn't available? Oh, shit. <sighs> Sorry about that. Hey, at least we know. What did blah blah blah. Probably right, maybe I can find out who has it. But, is the book really going to solve my problems again? Any other options? No, you're right. If the book of the other half is your girlfriend thinks it is, it must be pretty good. I sure hope so. Alright. I should get searching. Somebody must have it. Ha hey, good luck with your search. If you need any help, you can come anytime. Thanks, I'll do that. Bye. Alright, I think we actually might be closing in on... I'm not saying that this episode is done, but um, I think we might be getting close to being done with this game because when I read the description, it's kind of short. Uh, probably not 30 minutes, but definitely close to there. So... Yeah, this might be a very... This might be a short episode or a long one. It just depends, I guess. Um... Uh, okay, let's... I am... I still don't know where to find the borrow book might be. Have you spoken to students yet? No, yeah, I'll do it now. Oh, uh, do we have to speak to the assholes that are, that are ignoring us? Okay. Mm. Can I ask you something? Well, I guess not, weird guy. They just turn away as soon as I get close to them. It couldn't be more obvious. It doesn't make any sense. He's just compl ignoring me completely. Ugh, God. Ah, oh, la 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 la. Where else can I go from here? Like... Oh, maybe it's in here. Tomoko's stack of books. Hey, Tomoko. Hi, Selena. The group of students obviously doesn't want to have anything to do with me. The blonde guy keeps ignoring me. Peter? I have no idea what his name is. <sighs> and he is still with them. What do you mean? I'm not particularly proud of it. But a few years ago, I was in an elite student organization. And P Peter was in it as well. That sounds really exciting. Exciting? On the contrary. In principle, they do nothing more than feel better than normal students. 
and have confirmed themselves in what that belief. Okay, that doesn't sound particularly exciting after all. Like I said, I wasn't part of it for very long. I just couldn't stand these arrogant idiots. Yeah, but what gave you the idea earlier that Peter is still a part of this organization? Because the members only talk to the other members, not to normal students. Uh, now I understand. Members reveal themselves to others using a secret password. Only then they communicate with each other. Do you still know the password? Yes, but I don't know if it's still up to date. It's been a while since I was a member. What was it? Photogen. Ah, oh, that's a strange password. Yes, it's something super occult. Only the cool kids know. Interesting. I'm just gonna try. Maybe the password still works. Good luck. Thank you. Alright, Peter. Photogen! Oh. Why didn't you say you were a member of the association right away? Um, uh, I joined only recently. I haven't seen you at the meetings. Which is why I didn't... Yeah, I haven't been to a meeting in a long time. Too long. I... I don't have a lot of contact to other students. Me? Uh, never mind. Pleasure to meet you. I'm Selena. I'm new. My name is Peter. Welcome. Thanks. Looking for a book. It's Lent. Can I ask you a question? What is it? I'm looking for a book on painting, but I think it's permanently Lent. Do you have any idea where it is or who could tell me? Ugh. You don't know anything. Well, it's like that. Uh, I lent it. Really? That's great. So how long do you think you're going to need it? I, I'm not sure. I'm afraid it'll still be a while. But I'd rather we not talk about that. Pleasure to meet you. Bye. But bye. Oh, shady. Oh, apparently I offended him. Did I say anything wrong? Oh my... Okay, crazy theory time. Okay, so that roommate of uh, Tomoko's, maybe she and Peter knew each other. Something happened, and Peter took care of the roommate in a way that might be illegal. What I'm trying to say is that Peter murdered the roommate, and he doesn't know where the book is. <laughs> oh, well, that's just a theory. Let's talk to Tomoko. Have you found out anything about Peter yet? Yeah, he borrowed the book himself. What a coincidence. Now I've only got to find a way to get, it to get him to give it to me. Just talk to him for a while. Maybe he'll learn something. Yeah, that's what I'll do. Good luck. Okay, we're continuing to the psychopath. Sorry. Party. I'm really- Peter, I'm really sorry if I said anything. No, no, no. Don't worry about it. I was really rude putting you off like that. No worries. You see, I've been a member of the association forever, playing the role of a great painter. But actually, I'm starting to think that I suck. Don't be like that. No, really, I just suck at painting. I don't have a talent. Which is probably why I cling to that cursed book so much. They say it's the best book on painting. The best. So it didn't help you? Not really. I apply all the techniques in practice, but the paintings are bad. Like, really bad. I love painting. I love everything visual. Everything creative. Architecture. Sculpting. But I have no gift for painting. Have you considered just letting go and trying something new? It's easy for you to say. You're probably way better than me. Everyone's better than me. It just isn't fair. Damn it. Just leave me alone. Welp, uh, let us, um, let us continue this journey on the next episode. Did Peter murder the roommate? Is he as insecure as he thinks? Are we gonna eat a sandwich? Who knows? Let's find out next time in the next episode. Let's minus the sandwich from that equation. Okay, alright. I can't wait to see you guys in the next episode. Bye!